So let us see how we can get an IP address of a corresponding domain name. So let us start with uh, our SCIS Learn One. Let us see what is the IP address of that SCIS Learn One domain. So in order for to see that particular corresponding IP address, there are a lot of tools available on the internet. So you can go to a tool, what's my IP? We can go to that particular corresponding. So this is my IP address of my system in which I'm using now. Or you can go to another tool, the simply what's my IP.com. Yeah, we have some other tools are available here. So you can go to the DNS lookup. DNS lookup is a tool to find out the corresponding IP address, something like this, SCIS learn1.uhod.ac.in. You please enter the domain name. That's a fully qualified domain name, or what is that basically your URL? and click the lookup. So this SES learn1.uhod.ac.in gives the corresponding IP address. So this DNS domain name system has translated your domain name into the corresponding IP address. So if you enter the corresponding IP address onto your browser URL, you can see here, this is the IP address. So we can retrieve our Moodle website too with the IP address. So I entered the IP address and the corresponding website is been shown to us. Similarly, there is an another set of tools, the IP address. So if you are going to enter this IP address belongs to whom, if you want to know who this IP address belongs to, you can go to IP address lookup and enter this IP address and click the lookup. So you'll get the information about this IP address, which is belongs to the University of Hyderabad. And who is the person who is responsible for this? Also, you can get more results on this particular set. So so with this information, uh, I like to end this today's uh, topic. So more information about the domain name system, you can get it from our reference textbook. As well, you can watch the YouTube, the corresponding YouTube uh, address is given here to get the animated form of the DNS resolver. Thank you.